Hello everyone, Colorado Wait here, and today I'm back with another Pixel Gun 3D video. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys 5 weapons that you probably did not know are good in the 15.1.2 update. People are always struggling in this new update what weapons are really good and people that should use now. Now, and I'm going to show you guys 5 weapons you should use and that, in my opinion, are really good right now. So, yeah, um, leave a like and subscribe if you are new to the channel. I'll be trying to posting a lot more. Uh, for the craft for the next couple of weeks before school starts and uh, yeah um, yeah I'm gonna get onto the first weapon on this list now the first weapon on this list is the future rifle the future rifle is actually a assault rifle that a lot of lower level players actually unlock in pixel gun 3d but this weapon actually takes a very minimal amount of head headshots to actually kill someone now this thing is actually a, a bit more powerful than other primary weapons it takes less shots to kill and uh, if you're really good at aiming with this weapon, which I am not, I'm really not that good at aiming with this thing, and you will get easy kills if you're really good at aiming with it. You'll kill a lot of people. It's like what something like, I don't know, maybe like the Secret Forces Rifle was back in 2016. It's really, really good, and a lot of people should use it more. Now, I'm, not, I'm really not that good at aiming with it, with it, so I'll try my best just to get a couple kills here. But uh, as you guys can see here, it killed that guy really, really fast there. And it's really good. I'm happy of how well this weapon actually performs. A lot of the assault rifles did get a decent buff in this recent update. Uh, like all of the lower level ones. So a lot of assault rifles are pretty reliable to use. And they can always be used in higher levels. But uh, come on. There we go. It took that guy out really easily. You can get a lot of kills with it. If you use this weapon a lot in this new update, you'll easily get a lot of people with it. And uh, if someone uses like, something like a black bomb, you're not going to beat that weapon, but that's like the only primary weapon that's kind of annoying in this update. So yeah, be sure to watch out for that. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much it for this future rifle, and uh, yeah, I'm going to get on to the next weapon on this list. Now the next weapon on this list is the Brave Patriot. Now this Brave Patriot is actually, it's, the, it's I don't know if you classify it as a short rifle, but I'm going to call it that. But this weapon takes the least amount of shots to actually use. For Assault Rifle, even though it has a 96 fire rate, it doesn't fire that quickly, but this weapon takes 5 headshots to kill someone. So, uh, and if you're really good at aiming with it, like, I'm actually really good with this weapon, and I can always get good gameplay with it. And, uh, yeah, you can easily get good gameplay with it. It's a lot like a Future Rifle. It doesn't take that long to kill. If you connect every shot, you'll always get kills with it. It's really, really good weapon. I'm glad they buffed it in this new update. And, yeah, it's... As you can see here, I'm in first place right now, easily getting these kills. It, it, uh, yeah, you can easily get kills like that, even against someone with small bulbs. It's not too bad at all, like, especially if you're a skilled player like me, you can easily get, like, a lot of kills with this Bray Patriot, if you know how to use a lot of assault rifles in this game. So, yeah, it's definitely a weapon I really like using, and I think a lot of people, a lot of you guys will too. Easily gets kills like that doesn't take that many shots at all unlike other primary weapons even though this weapon fires so slow it kind of makes sense that it takes less shots to kill but it's still a really reliable weapon at higher levels definitely really good at lower levels just upgrade it all the way as you actually use it while you level up you'll easily get kills with it so yeah that's gonna be it for this break page let's get on to the next weapon on this list most melee weapons did get a decent nerf from this new update but this one's actually taken prime right now the chainsaw the chainsaw takes three headshots to kill. It's really good. I really always like using this weapon ever since it was always a three shot kill. But so uh, yeah, it's a three shot kill in this new update. Its weapon is one of the better ones. It, as long as you land your shots, which I'm not doing right now. But so uh, yeah, it's killing all these players. Sometimes it can beat the combat yo yo, sometimes it can't. It's a little weird situation, but uh, this weapon fires really, really, really quickly. And uh, this weapon is actually really an early unlockable weapon you can use. And uh, yep. Kills that guy in three shots there. Doesn't take too doesn't take too much effort to use. It's not super hard to use. But uh yeah, it fires really, really fast and it has a really fast mobility. It has 90 mobility, which is faster than most weapons in this game. Like only only the Dark Force Saber is faster than that. And uh yeah, definitely a really good weapon. Highly recommend picking it up. And I know this weapon's actually coins. I'm pretty sure all the weapons I mentioned so far. Except for the Brave Patriot does cost coins, so yeah. The future rival does cost coins, and this weapon, I believe, without the upgrades, this weapon is coins. But so uh, yeah, it's a really good melee weapon, one of the better ones you can get for coins, uh, for the most part. It's not always coins, you have to upgrade it for gems, actually. But uh, yeah, easily gain these kills right here, and uh, yeah, it's pretty much it for this weapon here. 
Now the next weapon on this list is the Thunder Spell. This weapon uh, originally was not very powerful uh, in its recent times when it first came out, but in 15.1.2, this thing's like a two-shot kill. This weapon and the Shadow Spell are literally the same thing. But uh, this weapon got a really secret buff that not a lot of people actually know about right now. So this weapon, it kills a lot of people really, really easily. It takes two shots to kill. I somehow run out of ammo like that, but usually does not happen like that. But this weapon, two-shot kill. It's kind of OP, but not really. It's kind of like the wizard one, but it takes it has less ammo, I'm pretty sure. So it's a lot like the wizard one, if you actually uh, know that weapon really well. Easy triple kill right there, and it destroys everybody you come across. It's a really fantastic spell. This weapon, almost positive when this weapon first came out, I'm pretty sure it was coin. So right now, I'm pretty sure it's coin. So it's really, really good. I recommend you guys getting it. Now the last weapon on this list is the Damo Man. This weapon did get another buff in this most recent update. Not another one, but it got a buff in the most recent update. That's what I meant to say. This thing takes two shots to kill, which is actually pretty good for uh, what this weapon is actually used for. This weapon is a uh, contact detonating weapon where it actually has sticky mines on the ground. And uh, yeah, it's, it's actually really good for closer range maps. If you're in pool party and a lot of people are actually in the bathroom room, um, you can just place mines all around the room. And people, um, you'll always get a few kills each time people have to go in there. And uh, it's a really good weapon here. So um, I'm going to try to get this guy here. Uh, for some reason, that was three shots there. It's supposed to be a two shot kill. I don't know why it was three shots there. But uh, yeah, Demo Man, definitely the way to go. It's not OP at all. I would say it takes a bit of skill to use like it actually stays on the ground it doesn't really contact on the ground it contacts when someone touches it so yeah i don't know the price of this weapon so yeah it comment down below and tell me how much the demo man costs right now i don't know if it's coins or gems so yeah um that's five weapons you probably didn't know were actually good in this game if you guys did enjoy the video make sure you guys leave a like and subscribe to the channel it helps out a lot and, um, yeah, I'm gonna get a couple more kills with this amazing demo man here. If people actually come my way. There's one dude right here. Okay, I missed that shot there. One tip with the demo man, if uh, someone's actually going forward to shoot way in front of them, um, like this guy's gonna go probably up here, you will probably most likely, um, get hit by these mines. If he comes out of that area, but he's in there. But, uh, basically, just predict where the person's actually going, and you'll always get kills. With this thing, definitely really good. All right, I'm gonna try to get two more kills probably with this thing. All right, that's one kill, and that's two kills there. So yeah, we're done with this video now. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one.